Hello everybody, hope everyone is doing well. My name is Chin and uh, welcome to my channel. Uh, today I'm sharing with you how I cook a vegan dish which I call chow udon. Uh, this is my twist on the very popular noodle dish in Malaysia. Uh, the dish is called chow kui tiao. So if you visit Malaysia, uh, this is a must-have noodle dish at Malaysian street hawkers. I hope you will try this recipe out and I hope you enjoy the dish as much as I enjoy it because it's simply delicious. And thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. The main ingredients include 450 gram udon noodles, 60 gram tofu cutlet slice, 80 gram tofu crumbles, half cup sliced oyster mushrooms, one cup bak choy or choy sum, one and a half cup bean sprouts, half cup scallion slices, four garlic cloves mince, one and a half teaspoon ginger mince, and one vegetable bouillon cube. Okay, we press the tofu for at least an hour, and then we crumble the tofu with the hand. We add one tablespoon of oil to the pan over high heat. We add the tofu crumbles. We fry the tofu for five minutes till it turns slightly brownish and then we set it aside. The ingredients for the sauce mix includes 1.3 tablespoon light soy, 1.3 tablespoon dark soy, 3 teaspoon vegetable oyster sauce, half teaspoon miso paste, 1.3 tablespoon ketchup mayonnaise, 1 third tablespoon sesame oil, mix it well and set it aside. We add one tablespoon of oil to the wok over medium heat. We add the uh, minced garlic and ginger and then we stir fry till fragrant. Then we add one veggie bouillon cube, break it up to dissolve. Then we add the oyster mushrooms and tofu cutlet. We stir fry for one minute. Next, we add the bok choy or choy sum and we stir fry till it just wilted. We add the bean sprouts and stir fry with a quick few turns. We add the uh, udon noodles and we cook for one minute. Then we add the uh, sauce mixture. We add the uh, fried tofu crumbles. We add half tablespoon chili paste. We continue to stir fry for 2-3 to three minutes, make sure everything is mixed well. Then we add the scallions, do a couple of quick turns. Then we dish it out and serve immediately. And we can garnish with the lime wedge and samba paste. Thank you so much for watching.